Good morning. Hey. What's up? What's up with it? How you guys doing? Good morning. It's Wednesday. November something. Like November... Is it the 30th? The 29th? I think it's the 30th. It's the 30th. Wow. What the fuck? Right? Okay. Well. Clyde, Eugene, Nathaniel, and Wallace. I'm going to need you guys to stand at each and all, every one of these exits that we got. Because we're going to need to kick some motherfuckers up out the room on today. Okay? It's just one of them days. Um... And I don't know where we about to go. I don't I don't have no script. You know, um, I don't know where it's going to end up at. Um, all I know is we on Audubon and ain't no breaks. So, if it ain't really your thing and you ain't really here for it, then therefore I'm going to ask that you walk out with Cornelius and Big Bertha and Lucius. And y'all go ahead on the extra stage, right? Because this ain't for you on today, okay? It ain't for you. Now, I ain't been on this motherfucker in a minute. I ain't been on here. I ain't said too much of nothing. I've been quiet as a motherfucker. Nigga been dealing with a whole bunch of shit, okay? And, man, I'm just here to talk to somebody. You know what I mean? Help somebody get up and get over their own shit. You know what I mean? See some shit through my bullshit to help you be like, you know what, nigga, I ain't half ass bad. You know what I mean? One of them. I don't know. I can't tell. You know, I don't know which way you're going to go with it. But I, if, it, if it can be a little fuel to somebody's soul, I guess we're on the right path. Hey, it is what it is, right? So, y'all got the, did y'all get these niggas out? I mean, is everybody good? Okay, we don't need this neither. In case the motherfucker just think, okay, somebody, yeah, yeah, we don't need this either. Uh, wow. Uh, I don't even know when the last time I was on this piece, honestly. I know it was this month. Uh, a lot has been going on this month, a lot, okay? Um, and so I don't know, I don't know, I don't know where, where we stopped at. I, I, I know it was around the time... When baby was in the hospital and he got out, okay, I think that's where we was. Cause I know I didn't come with no, nah, no, nah, cause I ain't, nigga ain't been on. Okay, so I know it was around that time when I guess I just left and I had every intentions on doing all these videos and cooking this and that and doing this and this. I did this little ham thing doing the day before Thanksgiving, and um, I wanted to try out this new little recipe thing on this ham, and it was pretty damn good. Okay? Okay, and so I did make a video about it, so I'm gonna put it together. And so, you know, if anybody interested, then there for it to be right there, you know what I mean? But it was pretty damn good, though. But, um, um, and I had did a video one day, I was driving in the car and I was heading, um, to baby's house, and I did a video while driving. I didn't post the motherfucker because. <laughs> I was just, you know, I was on one. I was, you know, I was saying things that I shouldn't ha had said. So that's why I knew I was like, okay, motherfucker, uh, nigga, uh, it's called Don't Put That Up. You know what I mean? So I didn't even put that up at all. And that was somewhere around the election time. And then after that, uh, my verbiage was kind of silence, you know, because I was really blown back you know, about the election and shit. And I had, honestly, I just quit watching the news and all. I mean, the news is back on right now. I'm kind of getting back to normal. But, damn it. Somebody calling me off of Facebook. Ain't that something? I got to get my phone over here anyway. Hold on, let me get it. Is somebody really calling me from Facebook? Oh, my girl, Shannon. Shannon calling. Damn. Okay. Shannon. Mama. I'm going to call you back. Okay? Y'all, this is Shannon. This is my baby. This is my motherfucking partner. Nurse practitioner. She teaches the RN program. Yeah. 
and uh, I'm so proud of her. I met her when I when we were back in nursing school years, years, years ago, and I had met her in school, and we have been just friends ever since. And now, she has her master's in nursing, and man, and so she she just she just doing her thing. But now she teaches at the college, at the junior college for the RN program, and. Um, but here in California, and that's my motherfucking partner. She's a 49er fan, or that motherfucker be at the game like it's the thing to do. I said, Is y'all motherfuckers win? Yeah, girl, win one shit. But look, check this out, though. Check out this gold and red I got on, though, my nigga. Check out this. I mean, we both talk real crazy still. I mean, yeah, when she conducting business and talking about neuro and all that bullshit, yeah, you know, she be on that. But when we be on what we be on, girl, if you don't check out this motherfucking what right here, yeah. That we still get out like that. No problem. Anyway. But, uh, so yeah, Shannon, I'm going to holler at you though in a minute, mama. Um, let me go ahead on and get this out for the rest of my partners that, uh, you know, ain't going to be able to do it like how you just did it like that. You know what I mean? So, anyway. So. What happened back then, man? I'm trying to figure out where to even go. Where to start. Oh, we were talking about the election. Man, that fucked me up. I was like, wow, you know, I was like, okay, um, you know, I was, I was, man, my verbiage was, was, was thrown off. I was like, I don't even know what to say anymore, you know, because for years, you know, I get so much flack on what it is that I don't know that be going on in other states and what I don't know about different movements and things of that nature. And, and so I just quit talking about it. I don't even talk about that stuff anymore. You know, after that last time, I was like, man, look, check this out. Because we ain't getting the coverage that y'all getting. So, then therefore, before I open up my motherfucking mouth and say some shit that, okay, uh, you ain't got the updated version. You didn't realize that they caught that motherfucker? Yeah. So, to keep from going through all that shit? Nah. It's best I don't say nothing. I don't say nothing. I don't know nothing. Because the coverage that we get is on a whole different level. So, you know, hey. You know, I mean, and, and if, and I'm certain there are, let me, let me, let me, and also let me say this, you know, because some people, uh, uh, probably think that I live, or I think that I live in a, uh, bubble. Um, I don't. It's just the fact that, you know, I, remember that don't nobody bring me no bad news. Remember that shit? In the whiz and shit, don't nobody bring me no bad news. That shit? Yeah. I don't want to hear no bad news. I really don't. I mean, I watch the news a lot, all day, because I need to know where the fuck I need to run, okay? They're going to tell me some shit about the pop-off down there in Malibu, nigga. I need to know, okay, a tsunami is coming. Okay, let me get all of mine, and uh, we about to go, uh, we going eastbound on a 10 motherfucking freeway, nigga. If nothing else, nigga, we'll be in Florida. You understand me? Yeah, I need to know which way the fuck to run. In case some shit's jumping out. Okay, y'all say, what now done happened up in Bakersfield? Oh, yeah, nigga, I'm out of this one, okay? Some niggas gonna cut loose down there at Pan State Hospital. Uh-oh, nigga, I'm gone. I need to know where to go. That is the reason why I watch the motherfucker news. If they telling me, okay, watch out for this. Everybody gonna get this letter in the mail. It's gonna have this dust in it. I need to know that. If they gonna tell me, okay, your cell phone gonna ring three times and when it do that, don't answer, it's gonna be this and that, I need to know that. If they saying that this motherfucker driving down the street and they flickering lights and if you flick them back at them and this right here gonna happen to you, I need to know that kind of shit. You know what I mean? I need to know what the fuck's going on. Now, nah, they might not be telling me what's going on in Day County and shit. I don't, who is it? Oh, okay, uh-huh. All right, baby. You look very cute. You got your little boots and shit on? Yeah. Oh, okay. I hear you got a little poncho. And sh I, look at you. <laughs> Check you out. Hey, mama. I oh. think I give me a scarf. This scarf is Oh, okay. Have a good day. You too, mama. You look very cute. All right, mama. What? I love you, too. What time is it? Huh? What time is it? It is 8.15. Oh, okay. It's 8.15. What day, uh, what day is it, Tioni? Wednesday to what? November 30th. Oh, okay. well, there it is. According to my baby, she said it's Wednesday the 30th of November. And it's 8 something another on the AM. Yeah. She's on her way to school. She don't have a first period or a sixth period. So that's how that go. Yeah. Um. So anyway, 
Man, that Alexa shit had me fucked up. I was like, wow. I, I, I was really, I was like, whoa. You know, you couldn't pay me to stay up in certain states. I'm, I, I don't give a fuck if the rent is free. You understand me? Okay, the rent is free or the house payment, you ain't got to pay that for six months. But you come on down here and you stay. Man, fuck that. Fuck that. You understand me? I'm sorry I ain't going to be able to do it. Because I'm, 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 I've am i grown accustomed to being so liberal to where sometimes, you know, everybody don't roll with that. Everybody like, damn, this motherfucker's off the chain. What? This motherfucker, this nigga, junk, this a jungle book nigga right here. This motherfucker ain't been raised like everybody else. No, excuse me, I ain't none of that, okay? It's just the fact that I'm right. I'm from right here and we let the good times roll. We ain't tripping them. I don't give a fuck about what you got going on. I don't give a fuck about, okay, you building that in your backyard, nigga. If you don't build that shit, nigga, I ain't calling the city. I, I ain't none of that shit, okay? This motherfucker next door, they doing this right. Okay, you just done done that. I ain't got nothing to do with that shit. You know what I mean? That's how it is here. We don't really just jump in our neighbor's business. We ain't got nothing to do with none of that shit. If we coming to get you, we coming to get your motherfucking ass. We ain't trying to come in and come, okay, well, grandmama's in the other room down the hallway to the left. Nigga, we don't give a fuck about that shit, nigga. We coming to get you. We ain't trying to come and blast on everybody because they just right there. What is that? Nigga, didn't I say I told you I was going to come get you after I got through with this motherfucking colossal burger, didn't I? Yeah. I'm on the way, nigga. Yeah. We coming to get you. We ain't trying to come and get your mom and them, your kids, and your ex-wife. You. That's what's happening on that shit. Don't need a gang of motherfuckers either. We don't need no posse or none of that old type of shit. Ain't we the motherfucking one starting off with that motherfucking, uh, what is it, drive-by shit? Yeah. Shit, huh? Yeah. We don't do too much motherfucking fighting. Now, we might have a, a lot of motherfuckers might not have their paperwork up to date. You know what I mean? On what they supposed to be really having and shit. You know what I mean? Let me just be clear on that shit. You know, but uh, anyway, on to something else. <clears throat> wow. <sighs> so, um, the election had me fucked up. Okay, so much so. Shit, Obama and them, them motherfuckers went on a close, a close escrow on their motherfucking pad. Them motherfuckers bought them a new home out there, out, out there by the water. You understand me? Yeah, they bought them a badass motherfucking mansion, paid cash for that bitch, like seven million. They bought the house. They bought a house here, and apparently, from what um, they were saying on the news, that they also bought another home in D.C. You know, for their baby to get done with school, and then after that, and then they come in here to stay. But Michelle is here all the time. She takes spin classes with uh, what's what's uh, Bruce Willis, ex-wife and all them. Yeah, all a lot of them. They all take spin classes together. So she's here all the time. So it's like okay, you know. I mean, it was kind of customary that they was probably. I mean, a, a lot of people knew that they was gonna, you know, um, be moving here because he had made that perfectly clear. Shit, when Obama come here, that nigga be at Roscoe's. That nigga done been in Louis Burgers. Yeah, your daughter boy. is attempting to reach you on your cellular device. Yeah. Your daughter is attempting to reach you on your cellular device. So, yeah, uh, it's some customary shit. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, it's some customary shit, you know. Yeah, you got a text message, yeah. Wow. Now, that's senior. We have a group chat, a group text, um, where Tony and the kids and, and I, and we all converse with each other in this text. So that's Tony and Tioni going back and forth on whatever, whatever. I don't know. I'm just privileged to it because I'm in the feed. Yeah. So, anyway. Um, so... Okay, so they they bought a house out here, but wait a minute, look, check this out though. How about y'all look California trying to do a California exit around this motherfucker? California was like, oh my god, did the did the motherfucking South do this to everybody? I mean, like for real? I didn't know I didn't know it was that thick down there. I did not know that it was like that down there. I mean, the y'all niggas ain't really got no voice down there. I hate to say that, but that's the way it looks. Like, you know, your daughter is attempting to reach you on your cellular device.
Okay, we're going to, this is what we're going to do about this. Your daughter is attempting to reach yeah. you on your cellular I got something for you, okay? Because we're going to just turn this thing down some after I figure it all out. Okay, yeah, like that. So we just going to do that right there so we can get all this out in the open. Okay, because they ain't going to just keep this being disrupted. Okay, this is disruptive. Okay, so... Yeah, so they had bought that house and everybody was talking about that and where they bought that house at, they were saying, they were talking about the different people that live over there in that area and the different people that have homes over there in that area. And so on a beautiful hill overlooking the water, it's, it's beautiful, real, real, real nice. So I'm happy for them. That That's cool. But California said, shit, we don't want to be part of the United States no more. They was like, shit, fuck that shit. Can we get that at Cali exit, please? Can we be our own separate motherfucking entity? Since motherfuckers don't understand where we coming from, let us just go ahead on and get our own shit. Okay? And what's so cold about it, <clears throat> you know, in which I guess, you know, people do be tripping off of, uh, uh, just, but it, it's no different than I'm certain, like, in New York City and shit, because I see New York, New York was, wasn't y'all blue? Y'all was blue, too, so I know y'all motherfuckers probably be on y'all own shit over there, too, and be tripping out on what's going on down in pork and bean niggas and shit, like, nigga, what is, what? Yes, sir. Yes, sir, ma'am, no. What? I, I know y'all ain't doing that in New York City, because we don't do that here. Ain't no yes, sir, shit. Nigga, if your name is Paul, your name is Paul. I don't give a damn how many times you work for the school board, partner. I don't give a shit how long. You 67? Okay, your name is still Paul. I'm not finna put no handle on it on no yes, sir, and all that old type of shit. What is that? Where is that done at? You know what I mean? So, I don't know. It's it's like a whole different um feel and, and like, you know... And respect, I'm not, you know, no disrespect or whatever like that, you know, it's none of that. Um, my my ex-husband is back in the South now. Tony's back there. So, it's like, but that's his, that's his stumping ground. That's where that nigga's from. And that nigga, that nigga went straight home. He like, shit, this nigga, this some comfortable. I'm comfortable. I'm like, damn. You know, y'all shit was red too. What What is this? You know what I mean? He was like, T, I don't know. This is this this is how this is how we live down here. I was like, man, look. He was like, Well, you know, we just do our own thing. We just know and do our own thing in our own little pockets. I don't know. I I, I, I ain't gonna be able to do it. I, I'm j i am I guess I'm just too liberal for that. I don't want no regime. I don't want motherfuckers telling me on what the fuck I you know what I'm saying, what you you can't do that. What what huh? What? Where is that done at? I mean <clears throat> I was talking to my homeboy, Carl. Um, me and Carl are so close. Oh, my God. He's on my Facebook all the time. And we used to talk back in the day. And, you know, got him a woman now and everything. He lives in Atlanta. And, you know, we're just, we're just real good friends. We're close and everything. I'm going to talk about that in a minute, too. Because how about Carl called one morning. And I was with my man. And my man was like, what the fuck? What is this going on with this? Because when it rang, his picture came up with his um, motherfucking uh, Baltimore Ravens jersey and shit came up, right? And we laying in the bed. He was like, wait a minute, what the fuck, what the fuck is this right here? What is this? And I was like, I was like, but what you mean, no? <laughs> He's like, baby, but what is this, though? What is, what is all this right here? I was like, oh, well, he live on the East Coast, and... You know, it's a three hours difference, so that's why he calling me at seven or something. You know what I mean? He could, cause it's like ten something over there. What is the problem? What is what? Is, what? You know what I mean? We that's how we talk to one another. We both be talking crazy as a motherfucker. It's regular shit to us. But um, anyway, um, so I guess we'll get on that too in a minute. I guess cause we're gonna have to have a little chit chat about my dude. Cause man, this motherfucker's wild. So, but anyway. What up? Y'all could tell uh, I got one up. Can you tell? Nigga, I needed it like a motherfucker. I needed it like a motherfucker. Fuck the rest of that shit. Cali exit, we trying to get that. We trying to do our own thing. Obama didn't buy the house on the hill. Fuck it. That's it. We blue state. We liberal. You can buy weed here. 
regularly, nigga. We uh proposition whoop that we went through. This shit is recreational use, uh, use nigga. That mean uh uh if you don't burn that whole motherfucking tree down, nigga, let the whole motherfucking right here. We gonna have a block party and everybody gonna do this. Yeah, burn that tree, whole thing, pow. Put a tent over everybody so then therefore it gonna be like a you know what I'm saying one of them smoke out rooms and shit. What you call that shit? What they call that shit, y'all? They call it something because they was they was showing when the shit went through when the um when the uh when you know they were showing the election thing the electric co- coverage right and different places here like Roseanne Barr she has her own uh you know how like they got like hookah lounges like different places y'all got hookah lounges well we have smoke spots like that where you can go and just get nigga top shelf uh yeah and can I get some strips some drops. Um, get, can I get a couple of those, uh, uh, Rice Krispie Treats and a couple of those Jolly Ranchers and a few suckers? Yeah. You can go and go buy it and sit there and smoke it and get fucked up, watch TV and every damn thing. Play pool, arcade games, whatever you get down there, dominoes, they doing chess over there. It's like a whole spot where you can just go and get fucked up, right? Regular spots, just niggas, nothing. 